Hello, and welcome to Garage Mahal. My name is Brian Niskola. I'm an author, and this is my studio. I spend a lot of time writing and inventing things in here, fixing things on the shop side, and hopefully you'll take a look at some of my YouTube videos, and hopefully I'm not getting you too dizzy spinning around. But anyway, I want to just spend a couple minutes today showing you how to properly tie your boots. After years of wearing boots, I figured I'd take some time and show some people the way that I do it, and it's kind of like years of trial and error, but I think I found a great way to do it. Uh, I wear my boots all day long, pretty much, indoors, outdoors. And the most annoying thing I always found was that they would come loose on me. But I found a way to keep them tied pretty tight. And anyway, let me show you how it's done. Have you ever wanted your boots not to come untied? Well, I figured out a way how to do it. Rather, over years of watching people tie their boots, most people tie them like this. That's how most people tie their eight inch boot. This was a Marauder Wolverine eight inch boot. Marauder is made by Wolverine. Awesome boot, I'll put the links below, but I'm telling you, this is the most comfortable eight inch boot I've ever had. I can wear it all day long. And after I show you how to tie it, your laces will never come untied. But anyway, so that's the traditional way. The way you should be tying your boots is I always skip this, these hooks. It gives you a lot of restraint and kind of like holds back on your flexibility. But if you have like really narrow, thin feet, you can basically just kind of pull them over and then crisscross. But anyway, if you do a lot of walking like I do during the day in my boots, this will work out great for you. Now here is where it comes the difference. Put one but two, tie it down. And what that's gonna do is that, that extra flip over is gonna cause some nice resistance against that lace and it'll keep it in the place. Now here, instead of crossing over, you're gonna go up on either side. And you'll see why in a second. Then you're crossing over, and then you're gonna put this lace through here. Then you're gonna put this lace over on this side. And see what it's doing? Instead of having the, the tie at the top, you're going to go through the laces. Because what happens is it pulls it nice and tight together. So then you do the same thing here. Two, cross over, and then you tie your knot. You can die, tie it double, but if this part it's not going to come untied. you got a good tension, and if you flex the boot up, you're going to see what happens. All the strain is put across instead of up here. It makes a much better tying, much better knot. So anyway, I'll show you one more time. So you're starting out at the bottom. You can skip over these two. Cross over. And you want to make not one, but two ties. Right there, get the tongue out of the way, come up, crossing over, through on that side, and on that side, nice and tight, cross over twice, and do your regular bunny ear knot. And then that's it. And that is how you tie an 8 inch Marauder boot. Any questions, please leave comments below. I'll be more than happy to answer for you. And I'll leave a link for these boots at the bottom. But you can tell they are a nice rugged boot. And I tell you what, they're waterproof, they're insulated, they're super warm. I've had these outside. I mean, as low as probably I think there was about 10 degrees the other day and my feet were definitely warm but anyway enjoy thanks